Okay, so this is the video about VLC Media Player. This is the latest version of the program. Um, you can download it, just type VLC into Google and you'll find it if you haven't got it already. Uh, Going to look at two things today. Uh, first of all is the, the dual screen thing. So you need to go to Tools and then down the bottom you've got Preferences. Click in there and you'll get this box comes up. What you want to do first of all is click down the bottom right hand, left hand corner it says all, click that box and you'll see it changes and I'll zoom in for this bit here basically all your settings that you're going to want to be doing are under video so just expand that bit there and you've got filters expand that as well and the option you're looking for is, where's it gone, image wall click on that and you'll come over here and this is the settings I use for it which are in there. Uh, number of columns, two. Number of rows, one. Active windows, I just leave blank. And then element aspect ratio, 16 by 9. Once you've done that, you need to go back over to this side, up to the top, and click on video as opposed to expanding it. Actually, click on filters. And then you can see all your filters on the right hand side. Go all the way to the bottom of the list and you'll see video wall make sure that's ticked and then just click save and then all you do is find your film wherever you're going to play uh, just find a film okay. and just double click the film and it'll start up you see you'll have two windows so two identical windows so drag one to your right screen double click it to make it go full screen do the same on the left and then with the right mouse button right click go to video aspect ratio and change it to 16 by 10 and then there you go you've got full screen on both screens uh, for whatever film you're watching it's not going to work for every single film some won't look right if it's a 720 film or a DVD or something like that. The one I'm using here is a 1080p movie, so it's got big enough resolution to work. Um, but it does look pretty cool. So yeah, that's that. Uh, next we're going to have a look at um, TV streaming which you can do uh, through VLC as well so I'll do that in just a second alright we're going to look at uh, streaming of TV channels now um, using VLC you need to open up your VLC and go to playlist additional sources and you'll see a list, list of things in here it might be different depending on what country you're in uh, but the one that I'm using or have been using is shoutcast TV listings click that then go back to playlist and then click on show playlist and you get this big box opens up and at the top it should say shoutcast tv click on that depending on how good your internet connection is it might take a while to come up but then you'll get a list of all the free channels that you can stream through VLC now this is dependent on how good your internet is so if you've got good broadband then you should be fine if you've got crack broadband like me, it might not work every time uh, and then you basically go through, pick a channel, there's loads of stuff on here it's HBO, HD movies just double click the one you want to try and see if your connection is good enough it will load up and it will open up the film or whatever it is so there's Alien Raiders there when it says it's HD, the quality's not great on that you can't really see a lot of glare in here, it's not bad, it's watchable um, yeah that's it, there's tons of stuff in there, loads of different channels uh, if you're a Family Guy fan like I am, there's about three or four different Family Family Guy channels, which is really cool. Uh, there's one there, Freaking Sweet Family Guy. Uh, they're normally just running 24/7, which is great. And the Family Guy. So that's it. There's a lot of other stuff that you can do in there, but those are the main things I use: the dual screen setup and uh, and the streaming. So. Um, I hope that's helped you out guys, if you've got any questions just post them at the bottom and I'll see if I can help you out. Cheers!